Hello, graduating class of 2020. A lot has changed in the past couple of months. Social distancing, sheltering in place, and of course, school as we know it. We left for spring break, expecting to come back for a final push towards graduation in summer, and then our lives were put on pause. We all held our collective breath as we waited to see when or if we could return to school. Then we were introduced to virtual learning, Zoom and WebEx meetings, and whatever tools it would take to finish our school year. Suddenly, spring, the most sacred time for high school seniors, had vanished. All the rites of passage reserved for senior year were no longer promised. The uncertainty was real, and we're all frozen in time waiting to see what would happen next. And now here we are. In spite of everything, you have managed to get to the end of the finish line. But remember that in order for there to be an end, there has to be a beginning. Two months don't define your high school careers any more than the way you dressed freshman year. You have had nearly four years at Shawnee Mission to look back on, and you can fit a lot of memories into four years. Like this 2017 Girls State Cross Country Championship. In setting so many school records throughout your four years as Indian swimmers. The football games, especially beating Olathe North your freshman year, beating Olathe West your junior year. It's Miles' uh, entrance into the North Main Assembly. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm never going to forget that. I remember the senior football players, coaching them as freshmen, girls and boys tennis players, developing and getting better. Like watching your friends run as fast as they can at each other in giant plastic bubbles. Them IROTC kids, gosh dang man, you were amazing. You were 42-0. Your very own TED Talks when you stood on a red felt circle at the front of room 102, your voice shaking until that well-deserved applause. Two of my favorite memories come from being your class sponsor. I remember your freshman year when we did hallway decoration for the first time. I also remember the homecoming float your sophomore year when you guys did up. You taught me to be a better person and you taught me how to smile through the challenges. Just the overall collective spirit of this group has been just uh, just amazing, even now. Um, even when uh, it's so hard to be positive, they continue to be positive. Our football guys, all the hard work you guys put in those summers, and of course those wonderful Wednesday night lineman dinners. Ultimately, you have overcome much adversity to get to this moment in time. Never forget where you come from, but don't dwell there either. You will always have your time at Shawnee Mission North to fuel your endeavors and passions in your next chapter. And make no mistake, this is your time to move forward to pursue your goals and dreams and claim your destiny. Leaving high school is filled with unknowns under the best of circumstances. You are facing challenges like no graduating class before. But have confidence and know that you are prepared and ready to face the adversity that lies ahead. You are ready because you have the support of your family, friends, and the Shawnee Mission North community behind you. You are ready because you've put in the work and now it's your time to decide what the future looks like. So remember, we are always here for you and we will support you all the way. Thank you for your hard work. Thank you for your perseverance. Thank you for the relationships you have forged. Thank you for all the memories that you have helped create at the Brick House. And this is the Brick House. The 2020 class will forever be a part of the rich tradition and history of this sacred building. Congratulations, class of 2020. You've earned it. Well, here's my advice to you. Always remember who you are. Remember that you are beautiful. You are strong, you are powerful, passionate, and resilient. Figure out what you want to be and who you want to be, and then build a plan to get you there. Always brush your teeth, and remember to say please and thank you. You can make this. You can do whatever you set your minds to. Like I always talk about, it's the journey that you go on, the process, that makes you as a person. And I know all of you are going to be just outstanding. Continue asking for help. It doesn't make you weak. It means you care. Keep moving forward and stay open to new adventures and new challenges. Please remember that no words are important enough to become defining factors of who you are. You haven't vanished at all. 
you're just beginning to make your mark. Always remember to love one another and be accepting of others. You guys have made a difference. You've made up part of what makes Shawnee Mission North great and we are really going to miss you. Remember that it's at these moments when things are the toughest. That's when you have an opportunity to thrive so that when you look back at this time, you know that it wasn't just pain you felt, but growth. And I will miss you uh, deeply. And now the next chapter is yours to write. Go live a good story. You've been making the impossible possible for four years. So why would you stop now? From me to you, the old coach is going to give you guys two claps and a Ric Flair. <laughs> Woo! Remember, it's always great to be an SMN Indian.